Today I'm going to teach you how you can color grade and use color correction on your videos in Final Cut Pro. The plugin I will use is a great plugin for color correction and it's called MLOT by Motion VFX. I also want to say that this is a really easy tutorial so I hope that you can color grade by yourself after watching this video. So the first thing you need to do is to open your web browser and then you have to type in motionvfx.com in the search bar. You can also find all the links you need in the description below. The first thing you need to download is the plugin called mInstaller and it's free. Press the button learn more and you will see the download page for mInstaller. Just press free download and when the download is finished you will install this application like a normal Mac program. And if you need some more help with the installation I will link a video for that in the description. When you have installed the program you should have this on your status bar. If you don't have the program in your status bar, you can go to your applications and press on the M Installer app. The next thing you need to download is the MLOT plugin. Open the Motion VFX site again and type in MLOT in the search bar. Before you can download this application, you need to create an account on Motion VFX. When you have an account, go to the MLOT plugin and press the free button. Now you should have the MLOT plugin in your cart. Just press the check out button and follow the instructions. Then you should see the MLOT plugin in your M Installer application. If you don't see the MLOT plugin in your application, you may have to exit the M Installer and then open it again. Before you start to install the MLOT plugin, you need to make sure that Final Cut Pro is not open. And then you can just press the install button and wait for the plugin to be installed. When the installation is finished, you can open Final Cut Pro. And then open your effects tab. And then you should see your MLOT plugin. So the first thing you need to do is to drag the MLOT plugin to the video you want to color grade. Another thing I always do before I use the MLOT plugin, I add a color correction effect on my video. Go up to the top and press all video and audio and on your right hand side you will find a color correction. Just drag the color correction to your first video. And now you scroll down to the color correction and press on the color board. Then you press on exposure. I always start to bring down the shadows a bit because I think it looks good. I'm not a pro at this but yeah, it looks good. Drag it to a level that's good for your video. When you're done with the shadows, you can try to mix with the midtones and the highlights for a better look. When you're done with the color correction, we can start a color grade with the MLOT plugin. You can already see a big difference and that's why the color correction is so important. Now we're going to use the MLOT plugin. You can go to the MLOT library or download your own LUTs, but today we are going to use the library. So press on the MLOT library button. On this page you can see all the free LUTs. The biggest difference between them is how cold or warm they will make your video. I made this shot in New York a rainy day, so I don't want to have warm colors. I want something colder. I think I will go for this one because it's not too cold or not too warm, so I will take the dramatic filter. Then I just mark the filter I want and press OK. Now the dramatic filter is applied to my video. Now you can see that the MLOT brings some more colors to my video. Now you can see a really big difference when you have the color correction and the color grade applied to your video. Together they add a more cinematic effect to your video and I really like the results. Now I'm going to copy and paste this effect on another clip. Just go up to the edit tab and press copy. Then you mark the other clip you want to have the same color grading on. Go up to the edit tab again and press paste attribute. Make sure that you uncheck the audio because we only want the video. And then you just need to click on the paste button. Now you can see that the color correction is applied to the other video. You can see a big difference compared to the normal video. Now I'm going to add some color correction and color grade to a video from Miami so we can use some other colors. Like the last time I add a color correction. I bring down the shadows to the level I want and I mix with the midtones and the highlights. Now I add the MLOT plugin again. This time I want to add something warmer because I want you to feel the hot weather in Miami. I will use the startling filter because I really like the colors on this one. And like before, you can see there's a big difference when you have the color correction and color grade applied. Now I just need to copy and paste the effects again. And now you can see why I always use color correction and color grading 
because it brings so much more life to your videos and some better colors. I hope that you have learned something new today about the color correction and the color grading. If you have any more questions about color correction or color grading or Final Cut Pro, just leave a comment on this video and I will try my best to give you an answer. And if you learned something new today, I will be really happy if you give me a like so I know if I should do any more videos about Final Cut Pro. Thank you so much for watching this and I will see you in the next video.